Hey, it's Sarah George from Connective Consulting. Let's talk about FOMO and JOMO when it comes to your marketing. That may, that may sound like a different language, but don't worry, you'll get it by the end. <clears throat> the key to success in marketing isn't complexity, it's consistency. Being consistent doesn't mean chasing new tactics all the time. Try this. Stick to what you commit to. Marketing success isn't complex. It's consistent. Convoluted marketing schemes are almost always just that. Schemes. You've likely heard the statistic that a person has to see you and your content and your, your branding seven times before they even consider you. Well, that number is now over 20. 20 times. And that number can be across all platforms. It doesn't mean just posting something. It means your audience member pausing enough to remember you and willing enough to engage with you. You are not missing out on anything by being consistent. It's not FOMO. It's JOMO. <laughs> Let me tell you what that means. FOMO or fear on missing Fear of missing out on a new marketing tactic is not missing out. <laughs> you may think that if you don't do what everyone else is doing, you're missing something. There may be times to address a new marketing tactic, but that's not a regular thing for you. Maintaining your consistent marketing schedule will not steer you wrong if you have a simple lead measuring system in place. How about joy of missing out on stress or JOMO? Consistent, constantly, not consistently, constantly chasing new marketing trends is stressful. Maintain an attitude of joy, knowing that what you're doing works. Put your blinders on and do your thing. You can build loyal relationships through authentic content. When your audience relates to you, they're not even looking at the competition. They know, like, and trust factor shines through in local marketing. You should use that. In fact, that's what it's built for. People buy from people. Whenever you're marketing or advertising, keeping the same consistent message makes your brand an experience that builds relationships. You may feel like a broken record saying the same thing all the time, but remember, your ideal client is only hearing it for the first or maybe 10th time. <laughs> Plan your consistency. Now that you know being consistent is the key to success, how exactly are you going to stay consistent? That's where having a plan comes in. Focusing on outcomes and a strategy to get there. Mapping out your course of action is the first step to any goal. Want some guidance to make a custom plan that works for you and know some it's something that you can stick to? Join me for Captivate Ideal Clients. Registration is open now through October 13th. And what Captivate Ideal Clients is, um, it's a course giving you space and time to create a marketing plan that will work for you, something that you'll want to do and something that your clients will be drawn to. And with Captivate Ideal Clients, there's four weeks of open office hours where you, me, and other small business owners can come together to brainstorm, create, troubleshoot, um, support, cheer on each other. Um, just gives, a, gives you that space to actually create a plan for yourself and a plan for your growth. So register now through October 13th. And if you happen to be watching this video after the deadline, um, I encourage you to check back because likely the course will be open again. And if not, schedule a discovery call with me because I'd love to chat with you and make sure that you can be on a course to on course with your plan to make sure that you're able to capture your ideal client.